Here with Mary Catherine Zender. Uh, Mary, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Mary Catherine Zender. I'm a sophomore here at the Academy and um, I'm from Carl Place, New York. Great. And uh, how long were you gone and uh, where did you go when you were on your sea year? I was out to sea for 105 days. I went down the East Coast and then I went over to Spain and then over to the Middle East. Awesome. Uh, what specifically did you have to do while you were on board the vessels? Um, my daily experience was I worked four hours on deck with the crew doing random things. I also uh, did watch to watch for four hours every day. Great. What was your favorite experience while you were at sea? Out at sea, my favorite experience was going to Aqua Jordan, going to all the marketplaces and hanging out with the crew outside. Great. Uh, how was your transition back to school at Merchant Marine Academy? Um, I thought it was going to be easier than it was. It was a little hard to start off because all the school work and to get all your projects in. But um, I'm back to normal now. So. Great. What would you say is the number one thing that you learned that you can apply or relate to your coursework while you're at sea? The number, thing, number one thing is definitely time management. You have to learn how to deal with a lot of different stressful situations than um, doing that with license and time management. Great. Uh, how was your transition back to your athletic season? It was it was a, hitting a wall at first, but um, I got I'm trying to pick up my mileage right now and everything. So it's getting slowly back, slowly back to normal. Great. And what do you hope to achieve this season on the track? I hope to get to where I was last year, hopefully, but hopefully always get better. Here with James Hicks. James, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself? Hi, uh, my name is James Hicks. I'm from Hen Heights, New Jersey. Uh, this is my third class year at Kings Point, and I'm on the men's tennis team. Great. James, how long were you gone for, and where did you go on your sea year? So I was gone for 107 days. My ship traveled to Northern Europe. I was on the Charleston Express, which is a container ship, and our run took us from Houston, Savannah, Norfolk, over to Antwerp, Belgium, Bremerhaven, Germany, Southampton, England, back to Charleston, South Carolina, Fort Lauderdale, and back to Houston. All right, James, what specifically did you have to do while you were on board the vessels? So I was uh, assigned to work with the third assistant and second and assistant engineers who are like the junior officers on the ship. And uh, normal stuff that we would do would be uh, working on main engine parts uh, with the second engineer, replacing them in port, uh, working on fuel oil purifiers. Uh, with the third, I would sometimes work on uh, the diesel generators, which supply all the electricity to the ship, uh, uh, cleaning out the sea strainers, which uh, clean all the salt water before it enters into the main salt water system. Great, what was your favorite experience while out at sea? Uh, probably going to Antwerp, Belgium, or uh, Amsterdam in the Netherlands. Really cool cities, a lot different from US cities. Uh, really fun, uh, great architecture, and uh, a lot of good food too. Great, how was your transition back into school at uh, Merchant Marine Academy? Uh, school wasn't too hard of a transition back because I was spending a lot of time at sea doing projects and uh, the time management when I was out on the ship was actually a lot worse than it, a lot more difficult than at King's Point, so it wasn't too hard to change over. Great, what would you say the number one thing that you uh, learned that you can apply to or relate to your coursework while you were at sea? Definitely time management because when you're here as a plebe, you have a lot of different uh, tasks and responsibilities that you have to fit in with all your academic coursework and whatnot, but when you're out at sea, you're working eight hours a day, seven days a week, and on top of that, you, I was putting in like three, three hours a day on my projects, so it really uh, adds up. Great, and how is your transition back into your athletic season? Uh, definitely more difficult than the transition in, from uh, back into the academic setting, because uh, all the muscle memory and stuff's gone, so I'm trying to pick it up from scratch, kind of, and uh, making some progress, but it's pretty tough. Okay, what do you hope to achieve this season on the uh, courts? I'm just trying to get back to how I was playing last year. Uh, I'm having some tough, uh, some difficulty with my forehand, but hope that I can uh, build that back up, and then hopefully we can win some more conference matches. Excellent. All right. Thanks, James. Thanks a lot. Cool.